Tradition of Historiography We have learnt about the historical research method, critically examining the historical sources and writing the historical narrative. The writing of critical historical narrative is known as historiography. A scholar who writes such a narrative is a historian. The historian cannot include every past event in his narrative. The inclusion and interpretation of historical events by the historian often depends on the conceptual framework adopted by him. His style of writing is determined by that conceptual framework. The tradition of writing historical narrative, that is historiography, was not prevalent in the ancient societies of the world. However, that does not mean that they were not aware of the historical time or were not eager to know about it. Ancient people also felt the need of passing on the stories of the life and valour of the ancestors to the next generation. Ancient communities all over the world used various means like cave paintings, storytelling, singing songs and ballads, etc. for this purpose. These traditional means are looked upon as the sources of history in the modern historiography. Modern historiography Four main characteristics of modern historiography. 1. Its method is based on scientific principles. It begins with the formation of relevant questions. 2. These questions are anthropocentric. It means that these questions are about the deeds of the members of ancient human societies of a particular period. History does not suggest any interrelation between the divine and human deeds. 3. Answers to these questions are supported by reliable evidence. 4. History presents a graph of mankind's journey with the help of past human deeds. It is said that the modern historiography with above characteristics has its roots in the ancient Greek historical writings. History is originally a Greek term. Herodotus, the Greek historian of the 5th century BCE, used it first for his book entitled The Histories.